RN technology initiatives, like the one you'll see today, are intended to provide opportunities for universities, um, industry, and government to collaborate on research projects. And today we have an exciting project that will further the electrification of aviation. We have a project uh, team made up of The Ohio State University, uh, University of Dayton Research Institute, NASA Glenn, AFRL, and SAFRAN. And these organizations have come together to develop this technology they've been working on for a while, and uh, the results are remarkable. And the teams have done an outstanding job sharing their research, uh, collaborating on the solutions, and the result is there's going to be opportunity for this technology to have broad application with drones, eVTOL aircraft, fixed-wing aircraft, and even space missions. Our project is trying to use brushless double effect machine to completely get rid of the heavy and bulky constant speed drive and still get constant frequency output and at a high efficiency. Uh, you can not only use it for aircraft uh, generation propulsion purpose, uh, you can also use this for wind power generation applications. To supply power to these more demanding loads within the system, we will have to uh, parallel our uh, power generator sources in order to reduce overall loss as well as assist the engine as well as the mechanical systems. The technology now relies on the constant speed drive to give us a constant frequency output and with this technology we essentially um, replace the constant speed drive which weighs about 30 pounds and also um, have various losses within the system. So basically with this technology, we're able to achieve a higher efficiency, lower waste, lower cost solution. So I helped uh, work with NASA, Air Force Research Lab, Ohio State to come up with the, the topic we would propose on. We also worked with Ohio State to come up with how we would manufacture this, to implement their electromagnetic design, and make sure it was something that could be manufactured within our supply chain. I think OFRN, this project has been really helpful for SAFRAN because it did demonstrate that we can successfully pursue government funding from the state and federal sources. This technology will have great output and more efficiency with electric motors. and We are certain that it's going to lead to strong improvements in the increasing and storage of electric power and the transfer of that power into the propulsion systems of UAVs and EVTOL aircraft and fixed-wing aircraft.